Do you realize that everything that we see in our lives is the result and came into being because of cooperation? We think about it and we realize that our homes were not built by one man or one woman. It was a cooperative effort of many people. The same with our food. Our clothing is the result of cooperation. The world that we dream of, the perfect world of God, that God meant humans to live in, is evolving through the cooperation of human with human and humans with God. If we doubt for a moment the power of cooperation, we might ask if an astronaut could have walked on the moon without the cooperation of many minds and hands, without the cooperation of the prayers of many hearts. Let us consider how we can better cooperate with co-workers, with family, with friends, and with the people that we see even strangers, on a daily basis. Let us think of ways that we can help and bless one another. Now, cooperation involves many things. It involves a spiritual consideration, a spiritual determination, spiritual positive action. I pray today with you that you are a willing and a loving cooperator with God and with humans. And I pray that because of your cooperation, you are really able to make a difference in this world.